ha ha. Let, let this be right off a little bit. Ha ha. Yo, hey, 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 hey. PS5 reveal. The UI reveal. Do people still do, wait? Let me find out you were at Burger King, Kalo. Come on, man. Come on, man. I wasn't at Burger King yet. <laughs> yet. All right. We gonna pull up to Burger King. All right, but just not yet. What is going on, guys? It is your boy, TKD. One, two, three. Here back again with another reaction stream. Um, I'm gonna actually mess with the audio levels a little bit, just cause I would need to put up the state of play volume a little bit we'll, we'll do it right there but it happened guys now we have everything pretty much answered that you could even imagine or want to know about the ps5 right now i'm very very excited y'all i got the trailer right here not not another trailer i got the uh i got the state of play right here you know what i'm saying we're going to ride out for a little bit. I just want to make sure we get a lot of people in here. You know what I'm saying? Sorry for the ping and Discord server. Oh, man, you know. Do you people even still go to the Burger King? Some some people do. Some people do, for sure. But um, I want to hear first impressions, though. I saw some people saying they like it. I saw my homie Jack Move Johnny saying he doesn't like it. You know? Also, I don't want any comments on my hair. I just got out the shower like 10 minutes ago. Okay. It needs to dry, and it'll be fine. But I need, I need, I need everyone to re refrain on your thoughts on the damn hair, okay? You know what? I don't want to wait. I was gonna wait a little bit longer. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. We're gonna watch this thing right now. Is everyone ready in the chat? I'm gonna give y'all three, two, one. We gonna play it. So this is the PS5 UI. This is State of Play, Episode Eight. All right. I'm excited. I need a sneeze. Yeah, I need a sneeze. Oh man, jeez. Alexis has not seen it. Yeah, I haven't seen that. I mean, I have only seen screenshots and stills. I haven't seen the full thing yet. This will be my full. This this will be my first time watching it straight up. Um. PS5 UI equals PS4 UI 2.0. Okay. Hi, everyone. Like the hair, bro. Yo, Samurai. What's good, my boy? What's good? Also, big ups to Kayla for the dono. Much love for you. This user experience uh, videos came out an hour ago. Let me find out you went to Burger King before you start the stream. <laughs> bro, I didn't go to Burger King. I didn't go to Burger King. It was like 6 a.m. for me. I'm like, you know what? Let me just prep the thumbnail. Let me just prep the stream. Let me go take a shower. Let me go make some cafe. Tu tienes cafe? Tu tienes cafe? No? Si? No. Tu tienes? Anyone? No? No, no one wants cafe? Everyone's good? I bet. Yo, that motherfucker hot. God, yo, that coffee's hot as shit, damn. Mm. All right. Let's cut the delay. Let's get right into this shit. The PS5 user. Oh, I didn't mean to close the beats. All right, we're going to have a different beat track when we come back to the beats because I didn't intend to uh, X out the... Oh, well. There's one part I want to... Oh, you know what? Okay, fuck it. Let's get right into it, guys. Let's go. PS5 UI. Let's see what we got, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Stay Hi, everyone. I'm Hideaki Nishino, and I head up PlayStation's platform planning and management team, which includes product and UX design. Today, we are finally going to give you a look at the PlayStation 5 user experience. We will see some of the features that enable games to work together with the hardware and network to deliver a truly next generation experience. Our vision for a PS5 user experience is simple. We believe that your playtime is valuable and should be meaningful. PlayStation team members from all around the world <laughs> want to deliver a PS5 <laughs> experience that is completely centered around <laughs> you, the player, connecting you with a great play and a passionate community of gamers. 
With a look and feel that's designed for 4K TVs, the PS5 user experience was built from the ground up to take advantage of the console capabilities, complementing the transformative games coming with this new generation. I should note that this video tour is from a pre-production environment on the PS5 console, so there may be a few small wrinkles or minor changes once the console launches in November. And now, let's check it out, courtesy of our own Sid Schumann. The homie Sid? Sid Schumann, let's Thanks, go! Thanks, Mishino-san. Welcome to your new PlayStation 5 console experience. This this, wait, hold on, 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 hold on. This is new. The controller shits was new. The options right here was new. This probably can be the change your icon and stuff like that, or like your your name on your user. So that's not the biggest deal. But um, but yeah, yeah, those two things are new from the last time we saw this screen. We've already created an account and signed into PlayStation Network. So let's log in. In this case, I've resumed right where I left off in Sackboy, A Big Adventure. And here, we're looking at PlayStation 5's Control Center. From here, it's one click and we're right back into the game, but let's take a moment and look around. Is that the, the game Center running in the background? Always one tap of the PlayStation button away. It provides immediate access to almost everything you need from the system without leaving the game. This includes things like seeing who is online, checking the status of a download, managing your controller, power, and more. Interesting. These colorful characters are called cards, and they let you interact with games and the system in a variety of ways. First, as we've just resumed, the Control Center is showing a special card that allows me to get up to date on recent stories posted by publishers for games I am following. Another card here shows me recent media I've captured from my gameplay using the Create button on the DualSense controller. Okay. Let's check out one of the most powerful new features of the PS5 console. They're actually just to the right in this row, and we call them activities. Activities are part of the plan to remove barriers to gameplay. Let's get an example of one way they're used in Sackboy, A Big Adventure. With a tap of the PlayStation button, I'm back to playing the game. Sackboy, A Big Adventure is So the game is running in the wow. Each level represents Wait, that's one pretty type of fucking activity cool. I can play, many of which I can go back to later to discover more. I tap the PlayStation button to bring up the control center again. I can see a number of available activities, both active and suggested by the system. Let's take this first one, a big adventure, as an example. I can see that I haven't quite completed this level yet. I'm at 33%. Let's open it up and see more. Here I can see more information, including key objectives I haven't met. And Whoa. I'm seeing a very important piece of information here. It says about 10 minutes left. This is PlayStation. Oh shit, I wanted this forever! I wanted a how long to beat type thing. My voice cracked. I wanted like a how long to beat type thing for the menu for so long. Oh shit, that's hype as hell. Y'all, that's actually mad fire. Oh man. Personalized playtime estimate, giving me an idea how long it will take me to complete this activity. Some activities even let you jump directly to that place in the game. That's really cool. But there's more to see here. For another example, let's open that activity back up. It looks like I missed an objective to find the monk robes costume piece. Looks like I need a little help. Some in-game activities, like this one, offer official game help. Game help is included as a benefit for active PlayStation Plus members in some PS5 games. Interesting. In this case, I can open up that objective. It's behind PS Plus? That is really interesting. Web search, or digging through long videos or articles that might contain spoilers. This particular hint is a video, and I can play it here in the card, and I can expand it to get a bigger view without leaving the game. Sometimes it's really useful to be able to see the hint on screen while you play. Some cards can be put in a picture-in-picture -picture mode, or as shown here, a side-by-side -side view. 
Super cool. That's neat. And if you pin a card, you can access it via the control center at any time. Now let's go find those rascally monk robes. Thanks, game help. The team at PlayStation That's for the knee. It really easy to chat with your friends on the PlayStation 5 console. So let's check out how it works. Can you just join like that and not Here, have to go to the I'm menu? An Please. Notification with a tap not that I use PSM voice chat, but still. I decided to join the voice chat that my friend just entered. Now, my friend could have done this on the PlayStation app for mobile devices, from a PS4, or in this case, from a PS5. The DualSense controller features an integrated microphone, too, so I could start talking right away. But I always have the ability to hit the mute button on the controller or in the menus. Parties take on an expanded role with PS5, and they now provide persistent spaces to connect with groups that you play with. Here I have a couple of friends chatting away in the party. One of them has started sharing their screen with the group. I like that a lot, actually. Looks like they're playing Uncharted The Lost Legacy. Which y'all should play. While we play, and I can watch his progress as well. That's cool. That's neat. This is another card that could be put in picture-in-picture -picture mode or pinned to the side while you play. You can access it anytime via the control center too, but let's dismiss it for now. Yeah, I would never do that, but I mean, it'd be okay, cool to watch review. someone play for a little so bit. So far, you know? we've seen how activities on PS5 will make it easier and faster to hop back into PS5 games, and how you can get in-game help and chat with your friends. So that leaves online multiplayer gaming. Let's check it out. I see that some of my friends are online, so it's time to say goodbye to Sackboy for now and spin up a match of Destruction All-Stars. One of my friends in the party has already started a match, and we can join them from this card in Control Center. And there we go. Destruction All-Stars now quickly starts thanks to PS5's ultra-high-speed SSD. Okay, I think we've got enough people on our party, so let's jump in. We're keeping the focus on PS5's user experience today, so let's zip ahead so we can see more. Three. Actually, yeah, I actually like haven't seen gameplay for this game, actually. We don't have time to play a full From match From Destruction All-Stars? I, I actually haven't seen to it. A quick photo. To do that, I'll just tap the Create button on the DualSense controller. PS5 is always capturing recent gameplay, but when you compose a shot, even using in-game photo mode, you can capture a high-quality screenshot here. This optimizes capturing the moment, letting it's so you review fast, thank and choose God. to share later on. I should mention, screenshots and video can be captured at up to 4K on the PS5 console. Let's go, that okay. 4K so capture, far, let's go! How to jump into activities, how to chat with your all, friends, get into to my screenshots on Twitter are about to be crispy as hell, my boys. 4K? Yo, let's go. Let's go. Share screen. Yeah. I, I know that share screen was on PS4, but I just, I just, you know, just, just, I just never used it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, so I'm probably never going to use it, but like, I still think it's a cool feature. You know what I'm saying? Like, I still think it's cool, but I'm just personally never going to use that feature probably. But I like the 4K play, captures. I like that a lot. Gameplay, all of that while in game. But what if I want to play a different game? So this is Welcome the menu the menu. PlayStation okay. 5 home screen. This is the home. This is okay. where you'll land when you start up from a powered off state and where you'll go when you want to choose a new game to play or download. The layout of the space is designed to present games and game content beautifully on a 4K display with simple and super fast access to what you need. And in case you're wondering, media related apps will have their own space like this one. But today we're focused on gaming. Each game has its own hub completely integrated, so all you need to do is scroll down to see activities you can jump right into. Video clips, stories about the game, DLC, and more. Backward compatible PS4 titles will benefit from some of these features too. Let's move one spot to the left and check out Explore, which brings together all your games. We okay. saw a view of this from the control center earlier, and another view will also be in the new PlayStation app for mobile devices. 
Explore keeps you in the loop with official stories from PlayStation and from all the games you're following, including trending media from the community. Okay. We'll be testing and learning about this feature in the U.S. at launch, so not everyone will have this on day one. But it gives you a good idea of the direction. And this is PlayStation Store for PS5. It's completely integrated into the system. Holy fuck. Oh, shit. Yo, the PS Store is just right there? Yo. Wait, that's actually kind of fucking cool. No way. It's right there? Right there. Like, dead ass. For real? So the thumbnail of this stream is the PlayStation Store? Wow. Yo, that, yo, that is quite interesting. That is quite interesting. Browsing for new games to play will be easier thanks to the speed of PS5 and a more wow. personalized store experience. And here, you'll be able to browse the latest games and deals. You'll find PS5 games and many backward compatible PS4 games too. I'm sad to say, but we are almost out of time. So let's pull up Control Center one more time with a tap of the PlayStation button. On our way out, why don't we quickly share that photo we took in Destruction All-Stars? We can find recently captured media in this handy card in Control Center. From here, we can do some quick edits, but I think I'm ready to share it right now. On PlayStation 5, I have the option to share videos and images to supported external services, or I can send them directly to one of my parties. That's Remember, cool. parties are bigger than just voice chat now. So I'll select one of my favorite parties here. Let's attach a quick message here. The DualSense controller makes this really easy. PlayStation 5 supports voice dictation in a number of languages, so you no longer have to type messages with the keyboard if you don't want to. Simply select the microphone button. Here's a cool detail. If my friend hasn't yet played the activity where I captured this media, and the game's developer thinks that activity might contain spoilers, they'll receive a warning before they view it. Well, mm. that's it for our demo. There are many more exciting features we couldn't get to today, but we're super excited to share more of the PlayStation 5 and PlayStation app user experience. Did y'all, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did y'all, did y'all, did y'all miss that? I saw this trending on Twitter. I saw this trending on Twitter. Hold up. When he, share right me. here. Do y'all see this right here? It says, uh, charge controllers download updates, and suspend your games, plural, similar to um, a feature on the opposing side of the console war, you know, called, um, what's it called? Well, yeah, quick resume. Quite interesting. It's, um, it's quite interesting. And then wait, I, I want to look at the rest mode screen because that looks beautiful. In the coming weeks, headed to launch, and of course, damn, this is looking kind of, yo, this is looking kind of hot though. This was just a first look at what fans could expect on day one. The team at PlayStation is com here's, you know, I, I, here I want to. It's interesting how they spent a lot of the time on the control center type thing, where it's like this like half UI thing that while because like, it's overlaid atop of your game that you're currently playing you know what i'm saying like i think that's what it i'm pretty sure because like like even even when he went back to the game from it it picked up right where he was right boy a big adventure oh and i know rest modes on ps4 but it it just looks cool on ps5 you know what i'm saying Rest mode be looking fire on PS5. But, yo, so, like, let me let me take a look at this. With a tap of the PlayStation button. Yeah, so that, wow, so in Control Center, that game is running in the background. Like, always. That's why. Go to the transition between Sackboy and Destruction All-Stars. That was a cold boot up. Wait, was it? Hold up. Let's, let's, let's take a look. Because I do want to spend more time looking at... So wait, let me see what he did. So this was play destroying. Yeah, so this was he's he's playing Has one game. Started a match, and we can join he them closes, card in control center. He closes Sackboy, and then boots up Destruction All Stars. 
Let's see. And there we go. Destruction All Stars now quickly starts thanks to PS5's ultra high speed SSD. Okay, I think we've got enough people on our party, so let's jump in. We're keeping the focus on PS5's user experience today, so let's yeah, that so wow. We can see more. Yo, honestly, that looked like a cut, but I don't think that was okay. Wow, that's okay. That is that is quite wild, actually. What I wish they spent a little more time on, which like I get why they spent more time over here. I wanted to look at more of the home screen. I want to take a look. So like, there's a settings up there. This is prob. I I don't know what this is right here. These are the games right here. I don't love how small they are. I get it's because to show all the info over here of like, oh, you know, like here's your, here's your trophy progress. Um, and to show off like the the 4K visuals and all that over here. But I don't love how small these icons are. I'm not gonna lie. I don't I don't love how small these are. You know. Oh my God, Keon's right. He he didn't even close Sackboy. Oh fuck, you're right. He didn't close Sackboy. He just booted up. Destroyed. That is fucking dope. That's dope. Yo, that's dope. Good eye, Keon. Good eye. So this must be like other applications, I guess. I know media. I'm never gonna listen. My PlayStation Four. Is strictly a PlayStation 4. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, that on the end is probably... Oh, you're right. The end is the games library. You're right, Owen. The end is the games library. Where we saw that um, during the... Uh, what's the name? Um, during the backwards backwards compatibility type shit. You know what I'm saying? Where they said, like, the games hub. This is... Yo, this is the games hub over here. This is the games hub. You're right, Owen. You're right. You're right. You're right. The icon size has strength because it's based on the 4K displays. Yeah. I, I mean, yeah. I mean, and, and I have a 4K display right here. Like, I'm looking at a 4K monitor right now. Is it in 4K? It's not in 4K, I bet. But, yeah, no. I'll I'll do it by myself in 4K. I'll do it by myself in 4K because when I try to process a 4K video, stream kind of lags. But it's all good. We're in 1440p. It's cool. Um... I wanna okay, so this is So this is definitely the capture gallery. I've seen that logo before with the is that remote play? Damn, I wish he My love, my baby's new Oh wait, we can um we can play a little bit of music. You know what I'm saying? There's some beats to, to vibe out to. You know what I'm saying? Can y'all hear the music? Oh my god. This beat is fucking nasty. Mmm. Mmm. Yes, that is the Chungi Legacy over here. Shout out to the Chungi Legacy. Chungi Legacy made on the stream. It is remote play. I wonder... Okay, you know what? Let me not judge this. Because these icons are, are, are gonna change as we get our PS5s. As we get new things on the console, you know what I'm saying? So... This would be like, this is literally analogous to looking at the PS4 menu when you first bring, when you first buy your PlayStation 4, how there's like random icons that you never fucking use. That's exactly what it is. So yeah, so that's remote play. I wonder why you would... Hmm, interesting. 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 Um, that's of course PS now over there. PS Plus. You'll probably see your PS Plus games right there. Instead of them being in the PlayStation Store, I guess. Now they're kind of here. I'm going to mute the homie Sid Schumann. Much love to you, my boy. But I want to I wanna check out something. So let's check it out. So, so this is the game menu. Okay. I wish they go back and forth and just look at the... There's a search bar up there too? Interesting. A search bar is up there. That's interesting. Pick and pick share play. 
Oh, is that what that is right here? Is 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 that what that logo is next to uh the Chungi Legacy? Compared to PS4 one, the PS4 icon is not pretty big. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. I'm gonna be sure like, yo, like this shit looking big. Um, but here guys, we have official confirmation about trophy per trophy progression. You love to see it. We love that right here. We we love that feature for us. Playing co-op uses share play to see your friend's perspective. Interesting. 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 I want to... They're pretty big? No, these are fucking small as shit. What you mean? Is there a browser so I can watch porn? Let's just take a moment of silence. Hold up. Let's just take a moment of silence. Um, hey, yo, Nick Fire. My boy, you are. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It wasn't you, Nick. I'm sorry. Hey, yo, uh, Venus uh, Kolopunani. You all right, man? Pornhub has a lot of console users. That's why. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. That's, um... Okay. Okay. That's um it's, it's uh quite interesting, sir. It's quite interesting. We over here are uh are uh, children of God. You know what I'm saying? We don't watch the pornography, right, gentlemen? Over here in the chat. We don't watch porn, right? What's porn? We're too busy playing video games. You know what I'm saying? We're over here playing Sackboy A Big Adventure. We're here playing Astro's Playroom. We're here playing Destruction All-Stars. Uncharted The Lost Chungi Legacy. We're not watching pornography. <laughs> no browser on PS5. They hacked PS5. Oh, wait. No. All jokes aside, I bet there is a browser somewhere in this. In this UI. I'm sure. I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure there's a browser. No cap. Okay, so the activities card. So, so this is where you can jump into different parts of the game. That's cool. I like that a lot, actually. So, multi so you can jump into... Okay, so this is cool. So, like, for example, right? So, this was actually released, like, back um, during the during a... I think a Wired.com Wired article or a Bloomberg article. Where like, so for example, right, let's say we were looking at Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, right? It would be like, hey, uh, Warzone right here, boom. Hey, uh, uh, you know, Domination right here, boom. TDM, Free For All, like, or this level in the campaign that you are, you know, working towards. Or Zombies, you know what I'm saying? Like, like th these are what, the that's what these are going to show. That lets you go directly, like, to bypass the menu and shit like that and go straight into the shit. Which I think is really cool. I think it's really neat. Um, I like, I like the face that now you can join the party without coming out of the game. Yes. Oh my God, Kia. Now, I don't use PlayStation parties that much anymore just because I'm just always on Discord whenever I'm playing games. So, like, I don't really ever use it. But I do like that, um, in a similar fashion, like what you said about how, like, oh, when you join a party, you don't get, like, booted back to the home menu to go do that. Um, it's a similar vein for sharing screenshots on twitter it's just a quick little menu like a quick little window while the game is still running in the background i love that actually i, I think it's really cool obviously there's going to be some games where i assume it'll have to pause it like if you're like mid mid boss battle you know or maybe it won't pause it i don't know but i feel like there's definitely some instances where like it'll have to pause it but what i honestly don't love about the menu guys I I i'm gonna keep it honest what i don't love i miss the blue of the ps5 I mean, of the PlayStation menu. You know what I'm saying? Like, it does look sleek. It does look great. I'm sure when I get hands on that, I'm going to love it. You know what I'm saying? But I wish there was more blue to it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I wish... I, I just wish there was more more blue. But, like, uh, that's just me. You know what I'm saying? And, like, who knows? Maybe there will be an option in the menu to just, like, hey, if you want that, like, blue wave, you know, 
you can just you can just you can just put that on. You know what I'm saying? Or like if you want like some like blue like type shits, you know what I'm saying in the background like instead of these um screenshots and wallpapers, I'm sure there's there's going to be a way. You could probably change the color like basically yeah, yeah. Yeah, like I I mean, that's what I'm most like uh like I would I could use a little more blue blue, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. Um what else we got here? I just want to see what else if they go anywhere that we didn't see. So, so this explore tab is really cool. I like this because this is this is gonna show like official news from PlayStation, and I hope that there's a feature to like, hey, whatever game I start and I play, I want you to follow that game on the explore tab, so I can keep up with different news and information about said game. I think I think that's gonna be a cool way to do it. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, for sure. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's uh, let's uh, delete that message. You know what I'm saying? Let's uh, let's uh, delete that message. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Chungi. Shout out to Chungi, bro. I see you. I see you, dog. I see you. I like the shades that flashes on the icons. Wait, let me see. I don't like this track. Ooh. Hold up. Adios. Wait, so the icons flash when you move over? Oh, I see what you, yeah, that is sleek. That is sleek. I like that. 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 Yeah, that is nice. Like, if it's going to go full screen like this, like in the Explore tab, like, I totally get that. Um, I, I... I'm pretty sure there was something yesterday that confirmed that themes will be on the PS5, I'm pretty sure. I think there was something yesterday I, I read that was like, oh yeah, yo, don't worry, PS5 themes are are like are, are gonna be there. Oh shit, shout out to Killer that don't know. Much love to you, King. Everyone go say yo, I want everyone to say GG Caleb in the chat. GG Caleb in the chat. All right, where are my PS5 themes? I need my themes. Yo, same, bro. I just, I just want my classic blue wave type shits. You know what I'm saying? That's what I want. Will I be able to connect my Bluetooth headphones um, to PS5? Yes, I'm pretty. I'm, I'm, I, I'm almost 100% sure you can. I'm pretty sure you can. Edit photos, make your own themes. That'd be cool. That's something PS5 would never do. I can't believe the PlayStation Store is right there. That's like wild to me. There's that PlayStation Plus collection. We got Godfall. We got 2K. We got FIFA 21. We got Sackboy. We got Ratchet Clank Ripped Apart. Fire. 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 I think this is the last tab he goes into, right? Because then he goes back into the control center, I think. I wonder if control centers like go up. What's interesting here too is that guys, like if you look, so like, so, so this home logo right here is how you get back to the home menu, right? Hold on, hold on. I want to get the controls from YouTube off. I don't think it's gonna go off. Um, you see, like right, right down here is the home icon. Notifications are right here. The friends tab, music, which is like okay, I right, like. That was kind of weird to see. I don't recall there being. Yeah, no, there's definitely no music tab. Now, unless they pull up... Now, I use Apple Music, right? If they pulled up with some Apple Music integration, because we did hear some news that um, the Apple TV Plus app will be coming to PlayStation, which I think is fucking fire, right? Not only because of that, because I hope that that's a prospect of, hey, in the same way that you can link your Spotify to your PSN and like have your Spotify playlist on PlayStation Network on your PS4, if we get that functionality with fucking Apple Music, I'm gonna cry. That's gonna be lit. I don't know if I'll use it that much. I'm gonna keep it real with you, but I think that's gonna be cool, and that will justify that music tab right there. I think over here, this was an I think for audio mixing. I think for like all right, like game audio or 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 chat audio. I think that's what that is. Mic for some reason, controller, maybe you can, uh, edit the controllers right there and stuff like that. Like, if you want to turn it off or turn the vibration and stuff like that. 
profile and then rest mode. Yeah, like, I assume Spotify is going to be there. Um, um, but I would love for our album, Apple Music to be on there too, low key. But that's just a me thing. Okay, does he go? Let's see. So we got the share, we got parties. Yep, okay, there's the parties right there, the Hiri. Fourth icon is social. Is actually, I should check, is. Is there a blog that officially says some details about it? Is there like more stuff in the blog? Let's see. No, okay. Look, 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 looks like there's nothing more detailed about the blog, actually. Yeah, no, I don't think so. I'm going to go to Nibel's Twitter just in case I'm missing some stuff. Also, while we're here, guys, make sure to um, follow me at PSSourceVids on Twitter. I will shout you out live on stream if you follow my account. At PSSourceVids on Twitter. I'm going to link it in the chat. Because, ha ha, why not? You know what I'm saying? Why not? You know? Bow. Where's my chat? My my chat just disappeared. Wait wait, how do I show my chat? <laughs> I hate YouTube Studio so much. Where did my chat go? Where did my chat go? Oh oh yeah, there it is. Goes to Shima is not seven and a half. Cut uh, cut uh, cut that shit out. All right, cut it out. <laughs> Who, who subscribed? I mean, the homie Caleb Kaiser just followed my Twitter. Caleb, how have you been a homie this long and not follow followed my Twitter, bro? That's like almost insulting. I'm not going to lie. We had the homie Bugs411 hit me with that follow. Much love to you. I see Caleb with that with that spider cat emoji already. I see Boogs with that Spider-Man Miles Morales. You love to see it. Ghost of Mishima? Okay, that's um, quite interesting. Alright, you know what? Actually, while we're while we're searching for other aspects about this UI, I think we should just show it on screen, honestly, Loki. Uh who else we had? We had De Devil Sh Yo, how come so many homies of the channel are just now following the Twitter? Are you serious? Bro, that's crazy to me. Shout out to Chris Scruggs as well. I see you from Oakland. I see you, my boy. Yo, my homie Chris Scruggs got a fire ass fit in his Avi, yo. I fuck with that heavy, my boy. That shit looking fire, bro. Yo, my boy is stunting. I see at that Tendo boy just followed me as well. I see your Twitch, twitch.tv slash that Nintendo boy. Much love to you. As well as. I see that hashtag Joy-Con boys forever. RIP the homie. Etika, much love. RIP to you. I wasn't that I wasn't a big fan of Etika, but RIP and condolences to the homie, of course. Always. Shout out to y'all. Yep. Keep keep following that Twitter. Also join that Discord down below as well. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. Hold up. Is 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 Prince Groove? The homie that just followed me. Hold up. Is who is who is Chris Scruggs? Chris Scruggs, put your name in the chat. I want to say what's 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 good to the homie. But here, while we're while we're here, I think we should just go to Nibel's Twitter and see if there's any more shits on the shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, who else we had? We had Chachi graphic design. Ooh, Chachi, you uh do some good graphics, bro. You uh trying to um, you trying to uh you know make some make some make some art assets for the boy. You know what I'm saying? We I might I might have to slide in the DM. You know what I'm saying? I might I might have to. I see you love some Travis Scott. You love to see it. I might have to hit you up for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I might have to hit you up. 
I'm on Tinder only. LMAO. <laughs> You'll love to see it. Oh, man. That's hilarious. All right. Let's go to Nibel's Twitter, actually. Um, let's, let's, let, let's check out what he has to say about PlayStation 5. Let's see what we got. Also, we could read some articles about it, too, here. I'm going to open that in our tab real quick. So, Control Center can be called with a single press of the PS button and shows you track trophies and, and get all relevant. So, with one... Excuse me. With 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 one click, you get to control center. Scruggs Gaming, yo, bro, yo, fit on your Twitter Abby is looking fucking flame, my boy. Much love to you, my boy. Much love, bro. Much love. Much love, my boy. Much love. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to him. Uh, let's see. New share screen feature allows you to not only stream what a friend. What 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 the friend of yours is playing right now, but also to pin their streams on the game screen. Yep, do you know that? Yo, I might I might have to hire that graphic artist, homie. You know, to to uh, make some dope ass shit for uh, PlayStation Stores, low key, high key. You know what I'm saying? Create button UI. Yep, we saw that. Looking nice. This is I think to record the last like minute or so or thirty seconds or whatever. Uh, I wonder what. The, oh, is this like the interesting? So I bet this is the manually record like right now. And maybe there'll be like quick toggles like on PS4. What's okay, like a double tap to start recording and double tap to stop recording. I'm sure that'll be back as well, but you can do it from right there. Um, Wait, does he click on this to share? I, I, I'm pretty sure he does. And then this is probably some settings about said screenshot, I guess. All right, here's some more. UI runs at 4K HDR? What? The menu runs at 4K? Yo. How the hell? How the hell? How the hell? It, it runs in 4K? Hey, <laughs> yo. What's good? <laughs> What's good? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is that PS5 UI brought to you in 4K HDR. What's good? Yeah, broadcast. Yeah, yeah. That's that's probably what that is, honestly. To like go live straight up, we can record 4K without no gala. Yes, yes, you can. Yes, yes, indeed, you can. Indeed, you can. I'm sure you probably can't stream in 4K, but I'm wondering. Official game help are context sensitive guide videos for PlayStation Plus. I wonder if those are going to be like user submitted guide videos or are they just from developers or like what's the deal with that i am very curious i am very curious about that as well like i wonder if those are you know from people that can submit user guides or whatever i'm very very curious hmm. switching to another game takes eight seconds yeah we um saw that with um sack boy and then going to uh hold up this this beep up the fire. Hold up, guys. Hold on. Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold up. This beep about to go in. Hold on, guys. I'm sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Let's let's just let this beep drop for a little bit, and then we'll keep it going. Hold up. Mmm, that's nasty. Damn. Are you serious? That was hot. That was hot. Covered the sheriff says, I'm going to use the fuck oh wait what? I'm going to use the fuck out of that and do insults. <laughs> that was so aggressive. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that aggression, but I appreciate it. No, I hope you can stream in 4K. I don't know if you'll be able to stream in 4K. Honestly, cause that's like, do you know how many do you know how difficult that is to to stream an output in 4K while playing in 4K on one piece of like that's that that is most streamers don't even do that just because like number one like it also requires the bandwidth of your internet connection to actually output that 4K resolution that's hard so I don't think that that I don't maybe the PS5 will be capable of doing it but your connection might not be capable of doing it. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing. 
Oh my god, Demon Souls is going to be so much easier now with this new card feature. Oh wait, that's a good point. Yo, I didn't even fucking think of that. Yo, I could probably be a From Software game and not want to die while doing it. That's a very good point. That's a very good point. Imagine playing God War 1 on PS5 without my help. Oh my god, bro, I don't even want to talk about it. I don't ever want to talk about God War 1 ever in my life. I don't ever want to talk about God War 1 ever. Uh, capture screenshots and videos in 4K. Love to see it. Love to see it. My 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 screenshots are going to be looking crispy as hell on Twitter. You love to see it. PS5 will let you run disk code just like PS4 that updates. What does that mean? PS5 will let you run disk code just like... Is that in the... Oh, here it is. Thank you. Someone asked. What does that mean, run? run disk? You do not have to connect to the internet first to download an update. And then be able to play the game, unless it's an online game, of course. It's more of a game preservation thing. It's something PlayStation still believes in, according to. Hey, that okay. Okay, okay. So this is cool. So you don't have to connect to the internet first, download the update to play a game physically. That's cool. That's cool. I like that. That's cool. That's cool. So what do you think, games? Like, yeah. Keep in mind, Desert All Stars in the video is a cold boot. That's neat. That was neat. Yeah, that was neat. Yeah. Kevin, you playing Demon Souls? I don't know. I'm going to try Bloodborne and see if I grow to a place where I actually like Bloodborne. And then maybe I'll play Demon Souls. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. But. Does Neville say anything else? I don't think he says anything else. But I want to go with it. Okay. Our first look at the PS5. Oh, my God. This shit is bright as fuck. Yo, I need some sunglasses for this. Damn, damn, yo, it's so bright. Why so bright? Why is it so bright? Oh my god, bro. Damn, yo, I can barely read this shit. Oh man. I'm not, yo, I, I bro, this screen is so bright, I can't read shit. Um, I don't even know there's anything new here. Let's see. No, passion is so I'm gonna pull my glasses, y'all. This this screen is too bright for me. Oh my god, yo. This is how this time will be when I play my PS5. Like, I'm gonna be like, yo, like this shit is so good looking. I need to like wear some sunglasses. You know what I'm saying? You know this blue Oh, I would love some blue light. Damn, yo, this is so aggressively bright. It's like insane. Oh my god. God, y'all need some shades in this bitch. Okay, I'm gonna legit do this. All right. Let's see. Um, concern. Of course, so this takes form of some uh, content-sensitive streaming videos to get you past uh, the current tricky spot without the user potentially being exposed to spoilers. These videos can uh, be run full screen or, or while playing via picture-in-picture -picture mode. You can even choose the video sits on the screen layer option. This won't apply to all games, and it seems that where it is available, it's flagged as exclusive for PlayStation Plus members. Actually, to me, it's like unlocking the hidden treasures in the game. So the PS5 UX is centered around the getting of players into the game easier and faster. And as you know, you can see they're making uh, they're making their available playtime more meaningful. We really care about this. It's an investment. I can play with my kids. I can play with my wife. But I want to play games. That's huge, huge investment. It's a part of my life. Okay. That is a really good philosophy, though, to make a menu. It's like, hey, like, let's make sure that people are able to get to games as quick as possible. You know what I'm saying? Alex Sanchez spitting that fire in the chat. PSI proving greatness once again. Absolutely. Also, uh, I'm going to drop some links in the chat just for y'all. Rock it with me. We, we got about 100 people in here. Make sure to do uh, a... Follow these links over here. Ha 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 ha. If I can find my links. Where's my fucking links? Damn, I can't. I can't find my shits. Description. Do, 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 do. Let me make sure this is right. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Make sure everyone uh, follow that. 
follow that Twitter right here. You know what I'm saying? Make, make sure to follow that. Ha <laughs> ha. Discord too. I'm gonna drop a Discord in the chat. Hold on, give me a second. If, if I can find that. Oh, uh, if you want to listen to our podcast, Road to PS5, Road to Miles Morales, right there as well. Bow. Oh wait, no, that's the wrong link. Whoops. That's 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 the wrong link. LMAO. I'm 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 trash. Hold up. Hold up. Uh uh. Should I freestyle? Uh. Okay, this is a link to our podcast on all different platforms, all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Uh. Yeah. Mm. Ah ha ha. Y'all. Actually, links are in the damn description. I don't know why I'm tripping. Do, 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 do. All right. Podcast, Discord as well. Road to PS5, episode 10. You are a real A. Hey, Chungi, you're kind of on. Chungi, you're, you're kind of on point with that. Kind of on point with that. That's that's uh, precisely what the hell we're talking about this week. <laughs> that is precisely what we're talking about. I kind of want to go over it. I, I, I kind of want to watch the whole UI thing again from the top, just in case you missed something. Uh, let me see about Tidux. Tidux usually has some stuff about some stuff. Also, if you follow me on Twitter, while we're on Twitter, I'll shout you out right here. I will shout you out if you follow me on Twitter. Make sure to go hit that Twitter. Follow that. Also, the Discord down below in the description. Make sure to do that as well. Let's see what we got. So Tyler just says he loves UI thoughts. You can suspend multiple games on PS5 if you want to. This is the video for a reason. Yup, yup. Yup, yup. Yup, yup. Last of Us Part 2. Oh, I think this is Owen as well. Shout out, Owen. Uh, yeah, I follow you on my alt account. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to him. Shout out to him. Ha ha. Uh, let's. I can't. I can't want to watch it again, Loki. Spider-Man remastered all the ultimate edition. You need Wi-Fi to download. I mean, yeah, like you need the internet to download it. That makes perfect sense to me. Yeah, because it's a uh, it's a code. It's not like it's gonna be a like a, a physical. It's not a physical game. It's not a physical game. You know what I'm saying? Damn, yeah, let's beat fucking fire too. Rematch of the moment is only downloadable. Yeah. Hold up. We the follower on Twitter. Oh, yo! Shout out to uh, J underscore the Golden One Nine. Shout out to you. Oh, I see you. Uh, oh, you a zombies fan? My boy, what's good, bro? What's good, bro? You like that Black Ops Four story, bro? How'd you like that? For me, honestly, I like Black Ops Three more than Black Ops Four in, in terms of story, but. I see you on that, bro. I see you be following the homie, Mr. Robert Waffles, Milo. You be following them Easter eggs. Much love to you. I see you, my boy. I see you. I see you out there. I can speak that COD, Black Ops, Zombies storyline. You know what I'm saying? Premise, Ultimus, all that stuff. I see you, bro. I see you. I see you. Hey. Hey, this is, this is, listen. The blood vials are the only way. You know what I'm saying? The blood vials are the only way. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. We can watch it one more time. Why not? Let's just rock with it one more time for a little bit. How fast would things download with a good internet connection? Um, it's gonna be a lot faster than PS4 because of the Wi-Fi 6 card. So it is gonna be a lot faster, but it all depends on your connection. But it should be more because of um because of uh what's the name the Wi-Fi 6 card. Than on PS4. Like, it's definitely going to be more than the PS4 because of that. But it all depends, man. It all depends. 
this is i said this during the ps5 showcase back in like june whatever but there is a certain like ps3 type of like feel to the ui as well you know that i appreciate from a nostalgia standpoint but yeah, Cold War going to go nuts. Dude, they have fucking grown up Samantha. Are you kidding me? That's going to be crazy as fuck. Samantha's grown up now? Bro, are you kidding me? Did you see when she put in the fucking phone number and it was Maxis? Come on, man. Black Ops Cold War Zombies about to be lit, bro. That's on God, no cap, bro. Thing about to be fuego. Fuego. Add user. Hey man, there's gonna be one user on my PS5. It's gonna be me. Maybe baby girl, whenever you know she uh, comes into my life, but it's just gonna be me, you know what I'm saying? So this this is weird, right? I wanna know. I wanna know something, right? So this this was a cold boot, right? Or was it in suspend mode? Because when he goes in and selects his profile, he goes into the control center. Do y'all get what I'm saying? Also, if you guys are watching the stream and uh, loving the content, make sure to like the stream right now. I want to see that like spike. Much love to y'all. Appreciate it. But definitely make sure to hit that like button if you can. Subscribe to Plays and Stories to keep up with the latest and greatest and Play Edition as well. Links below in the description. Follow us on all the other shits. You know what I'm saying? Much love to y'all giving that support, but that's what I want to know too. Is that um, he he doesn't go to the home menu. He he goes to the control center, which I'm like, that's weird. You know what I'm saying? That's like interesting. You know? I guess it's I guess I guess, but like, would Rust Mode take you? Wait, did he have multiple users? On his PS4? No, I mean, I mean, a PS5. No, he only had one user. So that's that's what he says. Rest mode in the begin. Oh, he he does say rest mode. Okay, he says booted from rest mode. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a fun actually. I'm fried. Cuz says the leak you ice cream almost look. Guess what, guys? You know what? We're gonna do a little story time. Story time. This was this was a few weeks ago, right? On my Twitter. Someone added me in like some video I made about the PS5. Like, like I forgot if it was like of the menu or like I did a video about PS5, something like that, right? And I had this account that kept tweeting me, hey, check your DMs. Hey, check your DMs. I DM'd you the PS5 menu, right? And I was like, okay, like, all right, I'll just look at it. Like, I know it's fake, but. I'll look at it. Why not? You know what I'm saying? I looked at it, right? And I thought it was looking suspect. There was, like, there was, there, there was some things on the UI that I'm like, you know, that, that, that doesn't seem legit, right? Lo and behold, lo and behold, we get the fucking PS5 UI. And I swear to God, guys, I swear it looks just like this. I saw this UI and I thought it was fake for, from this one account. And it legit looked like this. But then after so he just sent me like two clips and a and a screenshot of this UI and um I just, I just didn't reply. I just looked at it. I was like, okay, cool. Like, send my DMs, share whatever. Like, if I want to reference it, it's there. But I don't want to really put it in the video because I just don't think it's real. You know, like, I'm just, I'm just not sure if it's real. Whatever. And here we are. It looked just like this. I think the boxes were, like, a little bit bigger. And the media wasn't... And the media wasn't, what wasn't there. I don't have the messages no more. I don't have the messages anymore. I think he like blocked me or something like that. I don't know, but I don't have it. I'm going to I'm going to double check again, but I don't I, I'm pretty sure I don't have it no more. I'm going to I'm going to double check actually. Hold on. Let me 
I'm pretty sure I don't have it. Oh, this be about to go off. Hold on. This be about to go off. Hold up. Let me see. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't. I don't have it anymore. God, this bee is fucking flame. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't have it anymore. But I, I never saw a leak UI look like that. So I was like, damn, I really got a first look at the like for real dead ass head ass X Men first class looking UI, and I never got to say anything about it, you know. But I did get a first look at it a few a few weeks back from a random account on Twitter. I want to see the leak UI comparison. Yeah, I know. I wish you probably leave the message. I don't. I don't think I did because I remember saying to myself, okay, cool. Like, all right, it's there. It was in my messages request because I never followed the account. It was in my requests. And then I checked on it like two days later and it was gone. I was like, oh shit. Okay. All right. Like, I don't know. I guess he blocked me or something like that or whatever. But yeah, but I did see that UI. I never saw this of updated home screen. I saw a clip of him going from like shit to shit. What I think caught me off guard was that he had Cyberpunk 2077 on the menu. And I was like, I don't think you would have Cyberpunk. I don't think you would. I don't think you... I don't think you would have Cyberpunk on your menu like that. You know? So that, that that's what kind of made me think it was kind of fake, but oh well. It's all good. Don't forget to compare both PS4 and PS5 on the podcast. Um, We might, maybe. We might, we might, we, we might. Oh my god, wait, shit. We have we have the names of the shits down here. I didn't even see that. Game basics. So, okay, home. What is switcher? Switcher. Okay. Switcher. That's that's actually interesting. Switcher, huh? Okay. So I bet Switcher's going to represent all the games that you have in, like, a suspend state, and you can go to each one or whatever, you know? That's, that's, that, has to be what it means. For sure. No, no, notifications over here, then game base. Game base. Game base. Oh, shit, you can customize this, 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 this lower shit. Oh, snap. Okay. You can customize this and put other stuff in here. That's neat. That's neat. So game base is where we have recent parties and online friends. It's weird that they call it game base. I wish they would just call it like social. Right? I mean, that'd be, a, I think, a more fitting name for it. But I guess it doesn't really matter. Coffee's done, boys. You hate to see it. Can I get an F in the chat for my coffee? Because it's over. But yeah, that's weird how um how they um uh... wait what the fuck, guys? Breaking news. Wait, breaking news, guys. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Breaking news. Breaking news. I think Burger King just revealed the box of the PS5. Is that what happened? Y'all, we got some breaking news, y'all. Hold up. Wait, where am I going to find that as quick as possible? Shit. Yo, I think they just revealed the box. Oh, shit. Hold up. Pause the music. Hold up, pause the music. Wait a minute. Yo, this is breaking fucking news. Oh shit! Wait! Stop! Wait, go back. Go back. Okay, this is a this is called a Burger King fan Burger King Live fan reaction. Check it out.
Check it out, guys. Check it out. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's. At Burger King, when you order a two for five, you might get a side of PS5. Two for five, mix and match. Buy and Whoa, play game in wait a minute, guys. Oh, shit. There's the box. I know it's not the biggest deal, but that's still fucking cool. I want to get a good screenshot of it, though. Oh, shit. Yeah, there it is, guys. We saw... Wait, did did we see this, though? Oh. I know we've already seen the box, but, like, not, like, with someone holding it. Y'all no fun, man. Y'all are no fucking fun in this stream, man. Y'all are no fun. We have not seen someone holding the fucking box. <laughs> 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 oh wait, hold up. I'm gonna put up a tweet because because this is me. Hold up. I need everyone to like this tweet that I just put up in just a second. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Everyone go like the show that tweet. Oh, but I yeah, I I have a digital peeler, so I'ma have that sleek looking black box. Two for five, mix and match. Buy and play game in app for a chance to win. Alright. That was cool. That was cool. That was cool. That was cool. Shout out to Samurai. Oh, man. Oh, shit. This video was still playing? Damn, yo. This video was still playing? Hold up. So, game base is where we're going to see, like, friends and stuff like that and party stuff. Okay. Okay. That's interesting. I know they have like again. That's a big box. Yo, hey, oh shit! I don't have music. It's a big box for a uh, for a uh, big boy. I have seen the dual sense box. I like it a lot too. I like how it looks. Oh wait, does he go with the other? Damn it! I want it. I'm not paying attention. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So sound. Okay, so so sound. Wait, I think it said sound mic accessories, and what else? Switcher notifications game base. Music, sound, mic, accessories, your profile, and then power. Okay. 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 That's cool. Have we seen the game case? Yes, we have. Uh, Godfall game case got unveiled yesterday. I know you can look it on pushsquare.com. They have a article up there about it. You can look at that up there right now, too. Yeah, yeah, we do. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh. Watch it freestyle on my dual sense. White and black. Call that shit ebony, ivory. You already know how that thing go. Sack boy in the cut with the flow. A up for grabs level. Now let's play key success. I fucked up that whole thing. <laughs> I think, we, yeah, we, we uh, did see the uh, disc art design. We did see that. I think they've integrated more features for chat. I hate how to use how to use Discord when I'm on console. Yeah. Oh, Peter Parker's new face, huh? I like that. All right. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Godfall, more like no bars. I love this too, guys. I love the like. Hey, for this challenge, you have about ten minutes left. I wonder how they're going to track that. Like, 
I hope it's as intelligent as like, hey, we track people that have done this specific task and like, you know, we're able to um, discern how much time it takes, you know, and we're able to update that average, whether it goes higher or lower. Like, that's what I hope it is too. Like, I hope that they, you know, do that better. Hit the studio, man. You'll be a hit. I don't know, man. Should I freestyle again? Uh, 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 PS5, what about you and I, uh, <laughs> quick resume like we used to, I don't know when I'm going to play Sackboy, but I am, I am, I am going to play Sackboy though, I don't know when I, I don't know when I'm gonna play Sackboy, but I'm a I'ma definitely play Sackboy low key. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. I'm not sure when, but I will. I promise. What's up, Dragoncraft? Make sure y'all um make sure y'all go and uh follow that at PS Source Vids on Twitter. If you follow me right now, I'll shout you out. You know what I'm saying? UI, what about you and I? I like that, Cole. Cole, that was kind of fucking fire. Cole, I like that line. I like that bar. <laughs> I like that bar. PS5, you and I, but what about you and I? Uh, that was kind of fire. I hope it's intelligent enough to change based on your play style. Like, if I take extra time to explore. Ooh, that's a, that is a good comment as well. Yeah, so, like, rather than looking at the overall player base, it'll look at you as a player. But, okay, look, so, like, you take X amount of time to do this, so you'll likely take X amount of time to do this this other task. You know what I'm saying? I'm from India. Shout out to India. What's good, my boy? Shout out to you. Shout out to India. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to play Harry Potter. High key. I won't because I don't give a fuck about Harry Potter. I, I, I could care less. I hate Harry Potter, Loki. Okay, not... Hate hate the strong word. I just don't care about Harry Potter at all. It's not my thing. I think I'm going to play this in, like, December. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Probably play in December. You know what I'm saying? I wonder if they have, like, a dark mode on the UI for, like, notification stuff. Or if that's just, like, how it's going to look out of the box. You know, because I wonder if there's like a white menu or a black menu. I definitely prefer dark menus for sure. Like my my PS4 has been on dark mode since that setting rolled out. But was it showed more of the sort? Yeah, cool. I know, bro. I, I, I want to see that store for real. The store used to be so slow. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah. Well, was going to say it will be a while till I get the PS5. Yo, have they... Have they not confirmed India for PS5 rollout? That's insane. That's so sad, man. I'm sorry. That's 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 fucking tragic. Wait, I wanna I wanna I wanna look at something over here real quick. When he does that, does it oh this resume? Okay, so so it does say resume. Holy shit, y'all. Wait, holy shit. Y'all, you can mute voice chat right there. Check it out. Oh, wait, that's so cool. Look. You can mute voice chat right right there. That's really, really fire. That's cool. I stopped liking Harry Potter when JK stopped respecting trans people. Hey. <laughs> Yo, I would too. If I was a Harry Potter fan, I would do the same thing, bro. She's trash. Malaysia's pre-order doesn't even open yet. Damn, that's, that sucks. Same here in India. They the reviews to the rest of the world. India should should get should get a chance. That's messed up. I agree. That is messed up. That sucks, man. That really sucks, man. I wish the PS5 was just a global launch. I understand that's, like, difficult to do for some companies, but, I mean, I feel like you should just get it done. You know what I'm saying? 
But my dad went to his store and said that he will get it the moment it comes out. Oh, hell yeah. Shout out to your dad. Big ups. Shout, shout out to your dad. What's good? What's good? Are y'all going to play Destruction All-Stars? I don't think I will, to be honest. If it's a PS Plus game, I'll, I'll be down. But I don't think I'm going to buy it, honestly. The PS4 got rolled out in India, right? Um, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I forgot when exactly, but I know it was like America first, and then everywhere else was like afterwards. But I think it's going to be... Oh, I don't know that currency, but I think that's a lot from what you're saying, I guess, I think. Okay, let's, let's, let's take a look at this a little bit more. Okay, so we, we got the clock. Profile. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I would I would need in a PS5 UI. You know what I'm saying? But no, I think we're good. I hate how small the icons are. I think I think that's my only complaint. I think my only complaint. But like, yeah, I, I I think my only like uh is that I wish there was a little bit more blue in the UI. And I wish that the icons were just a little bit bigger. Maybe it'll look better on my display. And like it looks. I guess fine here, but I wish they were like a little bit bigger. Just a little bit bigger. You know what I'm saying? The game looks clean now with $70 though. I don't know about that. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And I like the uh, menu music too. It, it was sounding really, really, really good as well. I like the menu music that, that they were showing off. Cog equals cog. Wait, wait. Well, what is cog? Where are y'all seeing that? Cog is settings. Wait, what? Yo, Chungi Legacy Forever. Icons need to be small to make room for cards. Yeah, I can see that. Small icons may be better for themes. That is also true. I like that it's more space out so you can see everything. Okay. Okay. Maybe I'll just get maybe I'll just get used to it, you know? I feel like the logo should take up most of the screen. Wait, which logo are you talking about? Oh, like the actual um icons like the like the like the top bar over here. Top right. Cog Oh my god, fuck, the fucking gear. Yes, I'm sorry, yes, yes. The gear cog, yes, sorry, okay. Sorry, I don't, okay, my bad. I wouldn't look at that and use the word cog. I would just use, like, gear, but, but yes, okay, you're right, you're right. My bad, my bad, y'all right, y'all right, y'all right. Y'all right. Ow, oh, shit, pop my back. Getting old, yo. Getting old. Yeah, I wish the PS5 UI had a little more blue to it. Maybe there will be a theme that's like, hey, you know, like like what we're seeing right now is the default theme, but you can put on like a blue theme if you want. I would love that. Um, and those icons, like I I gotta get used to a little bit. Like like the actual selections on the menu, I gotta get a little bit used to. But I don't hate it. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. I think it's. I think above all else, what this UI did for sure is that it's it's definitely smooth. It looks like it's very clean. It looks like it's it's hey, as long as the shit works, we're good. You know what I'm saying? Did you already cover search? Yeah, we did mention it. I'm not sure what. I assume that's that's gonna be um maybe you can search your search like your whole PS5 or something like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Maybe like that's what it is. You know. Astro's a day one for everyone because that's going to be preloaded into the PS5. So get my P5R, Persona 5 Royal, and PS2 themes on it, and I'm good. Nice. 
I'm wondering how they utilize it. Yeah, I mean, we did get a, com a confirmation yesterday. I forgot where the source came from or whatever, but themes are a thing on, on, on PS5. You know, so we'll see how that all rolls out. But I wonder if it's just like you're not going to see these. Maybe you'll see a full screen of like something different on the PlayStation Store and on the Explorer tab. But I think everything else might just be like. Um. So, yeah, right. So, look, like you'll see full screen for the PlayStation Store. You'll see full screen for the Explorer tab. But I think when you're over here, hovered on the game. I don't think you'll see this background of the game. I think you'll just see the theme that you have on. That makes sense. That's 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 what I think personally is what's going on there. You know what I'm saying? PS Now is on is on PS5, of course. I'd be pissed if it wasn't, but obviously it is. Hopefully, hope to God, y'all. I'm bro, bro. Please, please. Please, the PS Now UI needs a fucking overhaul. From top to bottom, left to right, Y axis, X axis, redo the whole shits. We need to do it, like, we need a complete overboot rehaul of the PS Now UI. Please, if I go into PS5 and the PS Now menu looks the exact same, I'm gonna be fucking furious. I'm gonna be fucking furious. Want me to subscribe? Oh, hey, I mean, dra Dragon, if you want. I mean, I, I mean, absolutely, if you want. I'm down. You know what I'm saying? I'm down. I, I'm down. I think you, I, I, I think everyone here should, should subscribe. I think everyone here should follow our Twitter at, at PSOurseBids and, you know, all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Links below in the description. Shameless plug. But... Yeah, Z, Z axis, yeah, yeah, Z axis, X, Y, all the shits, all right? If they can pull out PS now, I mean, PS5 now, the way it's meant to be, Sega is just going to suffer. Hey, I mean, I'm a PlayStation now paying subscriber. I want, I want, I want the best for, for PS now. Because currently, we definitely do not have that. It's ass. I'm going to sub this man's a legend. I'm something. I, uh, I don't know about legends, but I'm something. I'm something. I don't know about legends. I, I wish they would scroll down. I want to see the PlayStation Store. Because here's what I bet, too. I bet the search is going to be not only for the PS Store, but, but probably for your console as a whole, right? So, like, instead of going over to the Games Hub and looking at all your games, right, you could just search right there real quick um, and do that, you know? They can do that by an update, right? They can, but they, the, have, listen, PS Now on PlayStation 4 looks like PS3, and that's a fucking problem. Like, that is a problem, you know? Like, that, that that's 100% a problem, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna need that to, you know, get a lot better, but that, that's just me. Subbing for the freestyles, oh shit, yo, I got freestyle more. PS Now... Let's forget about back then. Let's focus on now. Why your UI looking brown? I need that UI to not look so much like a clown. You see, what I want now is PS now to get better now. You dig what I'm saying? Stadia. That gave me agitaria. That's not a word. Um, I remember all the ads they overhauled YouTube with First Idea as if it would save it. Yeah, no, it's no, no. New face, you own Stadia games? Yeah, ask him. Yeah, who the hell owns Stadia? Peter Parker, do you have Stadia? I'm, I'm very curious if you have, Oh, shit. We ran out of beats. I got to queue up a new beats track. I'm like, where's the beats? Um... Let's do this one. Let's do this beats track. Oh shit, that's loud. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's that's a lot of shit. Uh. 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 
PS5, PS4, PS3, PS2, PS1. You already know how that shit goes done. Got that PS Vita 2, got that PSP Go. You already know how that shit flow. PS5 UI. I just want you and I to get together, play some co-op sack boy. Co-op. Co-op with that ought to be in the damn. I was ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh man <laughs> oh man i can't wait for ration and clank either man that shit gonna be fire oh this that slow type bi right, okay i feel that i feel that i feel that i feel that i wonder what see what I'm kind of confused about, too, is, like, remote play being on the menu. Because am I going to be able to remote, like, but then why would you want to, like, why would you want to remote play your PS4? There's a reason for that, that I'm just forgetting in my head, probably, but there's, there's a reason for that for sure. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure. I'm sure the reason that I just, I just, I just forgot. I don't know. I don't know. But let's let's end off this with just one more look at the end of it, and we'll see. Godfall for me is in the same tier as like Destruction All Stars, where like, if I can get access to it, I'll play it. And I'm a little bit more intrigued about Godfall than Destruction All Stars, for sure. Cause like melee combat loot, like looting open world, that sounds dope as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Um, but we'll we'll see if it actually turns out good and like rises above its generic looking like art style. I feel like, and it's like generic just presentation. I feel like of 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 Godfall, you know. But we'll see, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, yo, this be kind of fire. Uh. 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 Let's, let's see this rest mode bump into rest mode one time. And then we'll be on our way out. Yeah, guys, I think that's all we had. I think, I think that's all she wrote for this little stream right here. Hope y'all enjoyed. Um, make sure down below to go to our links. But if you're a little bit lazy, I can put it right here in the chat for you. Oh, nope. I can put it right here in the chat for you guys. All right. I'm going to put it right here. I need everyone to go follow the Discord. I need everyone to follow the podcast feed. I need everyone to follow the Twitter. All the links are right there. Podcast feed, Discord, our Twitter as well. All that good stuff. Follow it right there. All that good stuff. While we're doing the outro, I will, of course, shout out anyone that follows me on Twitter right now. You know what I'm saying? Or follows that Discord. When are you usually live? Honestly, I'm pretty sporadic on being live and stuff like that. But um, I do. Uh, we have videos that are here. We do um, streams. Like like last night, we were. Oh, the Discord link is expired. Motherfucker, I knew it. Damn. Let me drop the. Let me drop a new Discord link. Hold on, hold on. Let me. Let me. Let me drop it real quick. Um, here, try that one. I think, I think this one's going to work. I think it does. Does it? Yes. Okay. That link does work. Join that discord. Um, and, uh, yeah. Follow us on Twitter. All that good stuff, you know what I'm saying? Our anchor link, take it to our podcast. So 
We do uh, Road 2 series on podcasts where we go over the lead up to different things that are coming out. So we have Road to Miles Morales right now and Road to PS5 as well that go live on that go live on the weekends. You know what I'm saying? So uh, definitely check out that. Twitter at PSOR's Vids. Over here on the channel, we do streams. Like last night, we were streaming Resident Evil 7. We'll probably keep it going tonight as well. Because I definitely want to get through that a little bit, you know? Like, it was it was definitely spooky, but, you know what I'm saying? Um, so we only get the console and the controller. Yeah, yeah. We only get the console and the controller in the box. We, we don't we don't ever get a headset or a remote. I mean, I know with the PS4, there was the little, like, the little headset, like, half earbud thing. Maybe we get something like that, too, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But uh, thank you for coming out. Much love. Make sure to like the stream. Say subscribe to PlayStation Store to keep up with the latest and greatest in PlayStation. Oh, we have a follow here from the homie Cole at Fossil Fuel under, underscore Cole. Much love to you, my boy. Big ups to the homie. I think that's Cole over here in the chat. I'm pretty sure that's him. I think so. Shout out to him. Yeah, we'll 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 probably stream some more Resident Evil 7, honestly, because I kind of want to play that game a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so we'll, so we'll probably do that. Um, all right. Much love to you guys. Keep a lot to your own PlayStation source to keep up with the latest and greatest in PlayStation. Links below to our links on all that good stuff. Thank you all for watching. And as always, greatness awaits.